What is up everybody, welcome back. If you're new to the channel, I'm Brian on a beat. And today I'm going to review the human made Adidas Superstar 80s. To this day, Adidas Superstars are still one of the best selling Adidas shoes. These released back on April the 24th for a retail price of $140. And I have the box right here. It's your typical blue Adidas box with the white three stripe on the top. And it's been a few months now since I've been to the Adidas employee store or since I've bought anything other than Yeezys from Adidas. But I've noticed there is this label here with a bunch of Japanese writing. I'm not sure if that's been incorporated into the newer boxes. If you know, let me know down in the comment section below. I got a size 10 and a half. Could have easily gone down a half size. Again, it's been a while since I bought Adidas uh, Superstars, so I wasn't too sure. But I think if you got wider feet, you might want to stay true to size. The official colorway is cloud white, core black, and off white. There was also two other colorways to this shoe. They had a core black version with some white hits on it, and they also had a triple white. But the pair I got mainly has an all white leather upper with your black Adidas stripes, and on the stripes themselves, it says gears for futuristic teenagers. I'm not sure if adults are gonna be turned off by a shoe that has the word teenagers on it. I don't know but in between the stripes is a heart shaped punch out on the upper part of the heel is this black patch and it has the heart shaped human made logo i believe this is the only human made branding on the entire shoe itself the medial side of the shoe is exactly identical to the lateral side with your black three stripes as well as the gears for futuristic teenagers and the heart shaped punch out in between the stripes the insole is this light gray beige color and if you look closely, it has this furry fabric material. And towards the heel of the insole is the gold Adidas branding. On the front of the tongue, you have your gold and black Adidas branding. You work your way down, you have your flat white laces. The shoe does not come with extra laces. And on the toe box, you have your iconic shell toe, which is this cream colored and the same material as the midsole. The outsole has this herringbone pattern traction and it's also the same cream color as the midsole and the toe box. Now that I've covered all the details of the shoe, I gotta say the Superstars are one of my favorite shoes from Adidas because they pretty much can go with anything no matter what you wear. So how about we head outside and see how it looks on feet. There you have it. Hopefully you guys enjoyed the video. Now for my final thoughts is I, I do like the shoe. For the most part, it stays true to the, the original, to the classic look of, of the shoe itself. And, but for a price point of $140 for me, that's, it's still pretty, pretty steep for a shoe like this. This is definitely a must have if I would have went to the Adidas employee store and saw it for 50% off. Definitely a must have. So for a price point of 140, I think it's a little too high. That's why every, I believe every colorway and every size is still sitting on the Adidas website as we speak. I'm sure sales are gonna come pretty soon. That's really it. I'm curious to know what you guys think of the shoe, whether you love or hate it. I would like to know your thoughts and opinions down in the comment section below. And hopefully you guys at least enjoyed the video. If you did, please give it a thumbs up. If you're new to the channel, don't forget to subscribe. And until my next video, see ya. So you do get two sets of laces. On the back of the bag, there are instructions here. Number one, it says lace through center hole of lace anchors. Number two, lace through the top hole of lace anchors. And number three, snap into bottom slot. This is trim excess lace, leave one to two inches. For now, I'm gonna put